cool space engineers. It's time for another episode. Right on, Charlotte Moore here. So what have I been up to in this game? Well, quite a bit actually. I have been off mining here. I did some modifications to the grasshopper outside here. Now there's the place I was mining. Uh, basically there was a thruster in here that I took out and I moved over here. So what was happening is this thruster was actually destroying all these components down here. So I had to redesign this whole kind of s section here. I think I'll be able to return the, the thrusters there because I think I cut out this corner here which means now that when it thrusts, it thrusts just like under, where is it? Under here. We have a thruster that's hidden and it, it doesn't do any damage to anything so I think that's what we're gonna have to do so I'll have to move these over let's do that yeah so what have you all been up to I know I've been playing a little bit of Minecraft uh, some terra firma craft so definitely check those episodes out those are definitely uh, something different something interesting to check out I do have my old Minecraft uh, videos as well, uh, <laughs> just to give you an idea where I've come from, how things have changed, if any, who knows, uh, but I know for sure the games have changed, that's for sure. So yeah, so plan here is to fly back to our big ship that I've been working on, just to show you kind of an update to that. I've done a little bit of work on it, but I haven't really played Space Engineers much in the past you know, few weeks here, you know, ever since the last episode. So hopefully I'll be able to keep you entertained with this episode, just to kind of show you a little bit of a uh, few differences here and there. I'm not sure what else from last video, so this will be just like as if I haven't recorded. <laughs> So let's see here. So I'm gonna go back to my ship here and off we go. Uh, we seem to have changed some physics a bit with the thrusters, which is interesting. Okay, let's go back. Where are we? Am I, I'm pointing straight at it. Excellent. So let's turn off. They have changed the textures. I've also noticed that my ship seems to roll to the left now when I push up on the thruster. See how it does that? Uh, let's kind of aim a little bit down here. Watch. Push up. My dampers are off. Yeah, it's very interesting. I'm not sure how to describe it. I'm not sure why it's doing that. So, I need to figure a way around that. So, this base has gotten bigger. You can now see it from space. I removed the beacon off of it. Uh, let's see here. Let's slow down. There's a certain way of approach to get into this thing. I think it's like this. Yeah, I think. Or am I, is this the bottom? I think it's the bottom. Yeah, okay. So I'll have to turn it this way. Okay, there we go. Yeah, this is the fun part is lining up for, for landing here. <laughs> Right now it looks like a big floating box. As you can tell up top there's where all the cockpit and stuff will be. Uh, let's see here, how do we do this? I think we need to line up. We have to, okay, let's kind of reset the view, okay. Okay, so let's see here. Up, 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 up. Uh, the perspective of this is just terrible for s seeing anything. So, oh, let's turn off my thrusters. Large thrusters off. My spotlights are off. Excellent. So, let's see here. So, let's line myself up relatively good. There we go. F forward. I think something to do with the gyros, with the thrusters and the gyros, because with the small ship, I don't seem to be having any issues with the, the thrusters. There we go. Okay. 
So let's turn this baby around. Okay. Of course, for some reason when you turn, it doesn't uh, line up correctly. Yeah, please bear with me, you guys. <laughs> it's a little bit tricky this way. So one thing I hope they somehow, I don't know how they're gonna improve it, but as it stands, it's kind of challenging. Let's see. Okay, let's see how this goes. The big thruster's off, right? Okay. Yeah, and back it in we go. I think we won't hit anything. So let's take her easy here. The only problem is you gotta be inside before doing the side thrusters. That will really wreck havoc. Okay, no, I actually did pretty good this time around. Okay, excellent. So basically, we just line her up, fly her in. I'm uh, gonna push to the right a bit, just to. Uh, uh, okay, okay. No, I don't think they'll damage the walls, which is good. The whole point of the design here is to allow me to maneuver and adjust. I don't think I'll be hitting the thing up top. No, it doesn't look like it. Let's see. See up top there? No, and my ship docks nicely. So, yes. Okay. So, let's do this. And then I'll give you a tour of the ship here. Back it up a bit more. Okay. Now. Fun part is lining up this thing. So we we'll put it just enough. I think a tad more, and then it's good. Yeah, and then now down. Just push this up a bit. I didn't even check up top there, shoot. I gotta look up there if I destroyed those my thrusters up top. Completely forgot about those thrusters. Uh, this way. Okay. Okay. Where's that? I'm just trying to see the collector thing looks like it is. Uh, I wanna go back more probably. Uh, it's so hard. I think there, let's drop it down a little bit lower. And we will probably lock it right there. There we go, guys. So that is how we do it. That's how we land it. Let's turn off all our thrusters. Just have the important stuff on the ship, the refinery. So, I ran into a little dilemma here. I was going to unload my little grasshopper ship before anything. And unfortunately, he is full, so I need to empty him here. Now, I didn't account for this thing to be here, but I think I'll be able to fit underneath that to be able to empty into the refinery. Because I don't have a refinery in this ship yet. But I'll give you a little tour of this ship. This is, of course, the, the landing bay. I don't have any gravity here. People will be able to come in. So what happens is you can empty your ship. It goes through a pipe system or conveyor system into these two containers here. And the conveyor system itself, if you go up this way. Ah, let's go down first. Okay, so just turn my lights on here. There we go, now we can see hopefully. Um, in here will be kind of like uh, in the hallways. I'm not sure what's going to go down You know, those ways. We'll figure it out as we go. In here is the medical room. Uh, Gravity is so much better. Uh, this is so annoying. Okay. Here's the medical room. going to charge up here. Okay. And then if we take this up, it goes all the way up. Take it up. Here we go. Zooey! 
And here's gonna be kind of like an engine room type of deal. Uh, let's turn this on. Um, shoot, I need to change this gravity generator so badly. I need to move it around. That's because I need the access to the control panel so I can turn it on. So, anyways, you're gonna come up here, up here, around here, and then this is kind of like the main kind of cockpit area. And then up here is where the main control of the whole ship would be. I will be putting uh, decorative stuff down there, maybe more controls, more ships, more stuff like that. Or not ships, what am I saying? Ships. Uh, more control panels and all that fun stuff. So, yeah. So here's a good little status update for you. Just to show you that I haven't played much, but I am playing. I need to weld this all together. I plan on building a welding ship for that, and I'll definitely show that off. Not too sure, or I'm not too sure what I'll call that, but uh, definitely, you know, I'll definitely be on the prowl for that. Uh, so that way then I can upload that, show you guys uh, all of that fun stuff. And uh, yeah, potentially this welding will go a lot faster with that welding ship. So I think it's, it's a priority for that to get that done. Um, I'm gonna think about putting thrusters on this big casing here and we're gonna start fleshing out the, the ship. Yeah, so I, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Thank you all for watching. And you all have a great day.